Hey beautiful people, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my fresh face makeup look. This makeup look is for anyone. Mums, not mums, that kind of covers everyone then doesn't it really? This makeup look is for everyone, it's just a really quick fresh face makeup look and what I do when I'm really short of time but I need to put makeup on. If you want to see how I create this makeup look then keep watching. I have moisturised my face with the Garnier moisturizer let me just get it this garnier skin active moisture bomb super recharging antioxidant gel cream i love it actually i got it when did i get it i can't remember when i got it i got it like a few months ago and i've been using it ever since and i absolutely love it so i've used that as my base i am then going to go with my foundation you guys know what foundation i use okay you know if you watch my videos then you know Room will wake me up. Always use it, absolutely love it. So I'm gonna put that onto my fake beauty blender, Primark's own, really good. I'm only gonna put a little bit on, don't need loads. I am lucky enough to not have problem skin. Um, I'm then gonna darken it a bit, just with this um, Freedom Longwear Pro Matte Foundation, which is also very good. I use this dark shade just to darken up any of my foundation if I've been on holiday, if I've got fake tan on, I've got fake tan on at the moment. Can you see my neck's looking a bit dodgy? So that's what I darken my foundation with and that is a really good idea. So I'm just gonna put my foundation on with my fake beauty blender. I really like this one from Primark, it is so good. So I just had to delete a load of videos off my camera because my memory card was full. I really need to get better at deleting videos like that I'm not gonna ever use again. So yeah, just put my foundation on, brought it down to my neck, which you must always do. Never leave a line, bring it down. Just need to check my phone. I've, we've had a bit of a drama today, a bit of a family drama this morning. So my dad was meant to have the boys for the day. Um, hang on, let me just see our no sis let me just reply to them okay so concealer for under my eyes i am going to use uh the freedom pro conceal and correct palette i just always mix these two shades on my beauty blender and just go in under my eye this is just an everyday kind of look and it just brightens it under eye without it like looking too white so anyway we had a drama this morning my dad was going to take the boys out today go and see my nan with the boys um jensen already woke up and said he wasn't going he can be really clingy sometimes so he was like no i don't want to go i want to stay with you mum," which is absolutely fine he can stay with me that's no problem and then my dad sent me a picture of a spider a beastie man size spider yes yeah, so he sent me a before i carry on i'm just going to set my under eye with this setting powder it's not the nars one because i am nearly run out so it's a freedom loose setting powder i think or makeup revolution i will include everything in the description box below and i'm just gonna set my under eye with this powder i always have to set my under eye the way it goes so like wrinkly my concealer sets in my line so i have to set my under eye yeah so he texted me saying no he facetimed me saying i've just been bit by this spider i was like oh my goodness he said i'm in loads of pain um so i'm not sure if i'm gonna be able to come and get the boys today which was fine um he said like the poison's traveling up his leg i was like okay you really should phone like 111 he was like, no, it's fine, like, it's a house spider. Him and his girlfriend have been Googling it. Oh my God, have I gone up at OTT on my nose? Um, him and his girlfriend have been Googling it. And it's a house spider and it's absolutely, like, not dangerous at all. It's just painful. But anyway, he just phones me back not long ago and says he's feeling better now. So he is going to come and get Jesse, but not to a bit later. So, Jesse is having his morning nap. That's why I'm filming this video. So I'm hoping he doesn't wake up. In between the video because that is likely that he could do that so I'm just gonna blend the powder in with this big blending brush so if this makeup tutorial seems a little bit rushed it's because I'm trying to do it before Jessie wakes up because that would be a nightmare so yeah I've just set my face as you can see I haven't like contoured my nose or anything because on an everyday basis 
I wish I had time to do it, but I don't. So I'm gonna contour my cheekbones. And when I say contour, like it's a really quick contour and it also counts as like blusher as well. Yeah, so I had this big day planned of all these videos I was gonna film. And then my dad gets bitten by a spider, so. <laughs> Span it in the works. Span it in the works, indeed. Then go into just do my forehead. I just cannot not do my forehead because I got a big forehead <laughs> and it needs to be done. So I'm just gonna blend all of that in right now. I've just blended all of that in. I'm now going to put a little bit of blusher on. I can find it, yeah. I'm gonna go with my NARS Orgasm blusher. I've had this for so long. I can't even tell you like two years, if not more. So I don't even wear makeup every day. So if you watch my vlog, you know I don't wear makeup every day. So yeah, this has lasted me like two years and I've still got so much left. I've not even like made an indent. So although it's more premium, it will just last you so long. So it is actually worth it. Blend that in slightly. Also has like a bit of a highlighty sheen in it as well. So yeah. Now I'm gonna move on to my eyebrows and I, I'm just gonna have to do these off camera because not everyone has eyebrows that are as bad as mine. You will not need to watch me doing my eyebrows for <laughs> 10 minutes. It's so annoying. I have the worst eyebrows and I've got them microbladed, which is great. It's made such an improvement, but I still have to powder them in. So I'm just gonna turn off the camera while I do this. Brows are on and I just, lined my brow with my MAC concealer. I've had the MAC concealer for years as well. Like, I don't really use concealer much apart from just a light concealer. But if you do need a good concealer, then this MAC concealer is so good. I don't even know what it's called. It's actually rubbed off. MAC Studio Finish Concealer. Really good. Um, yeah, so I lined my brows with that. I was gonna put eyeshadow on, but I really don't have time. <laughs> so scrap the eyeshadow and this is just like everyday standard like i really am so limited to time when i do do my makeup with the boys here when jordan's here obviously it's a different story i have longer to do my makeup um yeah so i'm gonna line my lips with this rimmel lip liner La rimmel lasting finish lip liner and the shade is tiramisu i can't find my favorite barry m1 i need to get a new one which i'm gonna do I'm then going to go in with my all time, left my lipstick in my bag when I race, so I'm just going to go and get it. Okay guys, so I had a panic on then, I lost, I thought I lost my L'Oreal lipstick, I've got a few, I've found one, I don't know where my other one is though, so I don't know where that's got to, I'm going to have to find another one, probably going to have to go and buy another one, I don't even know how much it is, I haven't brought one in that long, like I just have loads lying around. How much are they? L'Oreal number three. I hope they don't ever discontinue that lipstick. It is the, the perfect nude shade. I get so many questions like, what do you use on your lips? And it's always, mostly, 90%, L'Oreal number three. I love it so much. When my complexion isn't very tanned, I always lighten up my nude lipsticks with concealer. So I'm using this shade out of the concealer palette. It just creates a perfect tone to your nude lipstick if you mix it with concealer. Like you can put as much or as little in as you like. So that is what I always do. If I'm tanned, obviously I don't need to. But during these winter months, I know we're only in August, but they're fast approaching. It's very gray outside. That is how you create the perfect nude lip shade. Gonna finish off with the Rimmel Scandalized Mascara. Mascara added, and I'm now gonna go in with my highlighter. I'm going in with the glow kit. You totally do not have to use a glow kit for like an everyday makeup look at all. You could use any highlighter. I love the Bare Minerals one. What other one do I love? And like Freedom have loads that I like. But yeah, just whack this one on. And that is your everyday fresh face makeup look. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.